Hi everybody, welcome to Tracy's Tuesday Talk for April 28th. I don't know, I think it's the 28th. Anyways, it's Tuesday and welcome to our Facebook Live this morning, our check-in. Um, I just wanted to shout out to everybody that I visited this week for Hugs and Hearts, our newest installment. The third installment is uh, available for viewing now. And I know that I come to your house unexpectedly and I, you see me in your house coats and in your nightgowns and in your pajamas and that is totally 100% fine and this is why I come to you this way today because this I'm doing it for you because you did it for me and so I wear a hat because then I don't have to worry about my hair I have a sweatshirt on because that's the first thing that I put on because it's cold and I need to be warm then my pajama bottoms nice and big pajama bottoms and my wool socks because I don't have any slippers right now and my feet are always cold. So that is me in all my raw, rawness. No makeup, no nothing. And so now you've seen me, so don't feel bad if I see you that way. We love each other and that's what it's all about. This is real life, people. So enjoy the hearts and hugs. Uh, I want to let you know that this week the newsletter will be coming out for May and June, so keep an eye out for that. Don't forget to uh, send in your prayers um, by Wednesday, by the end of Wednesday is fine because we actually do our filming on Thursdays. And so um, if you send in your prayers by Wednesdays, then I'll make sure they're included on uh, for Sunday morning prayers. So this week we have been doing lots of extra praying, haven't we? We've been remembering Nova Scotia through this entire week and uh, watching all the footage on CBC and different news channels um, and keeping those, those folks in our hearts and in our minds um, in the forefront of our hearts and minds really and uh, mourning for Canada and mourning as a nation and so that is a big prayer that is on my heart and I'm sure on a lot of people's hearts so um, thank you for that and keep those up um, and be kind to yourself about uh, making sure that you look after yourself in this time of COVID as well as added stresses like mourning and grieving the loss of people in our lives. Um, I'm going to leave you today with, uh, that's a magpie in my yard. <laughs> I'm going to leave you today with uh, AHS's uh, text for hope. I'm going to read you four uh, from this last week. So Fridays, Saturdays, Sundays, and Mondays. Um, so Fridays was connect over the phone or text with people who care about you and who you feel safe with. Ask for help when you need it. Now that's a great uh, encouragement because we are not very good at asking for help, are we? And we are not very good at receiving help, but we really do need it. And it takes a huge amount of strength to ask and receive help. So keep on doing that. And I'm proud of all of you that are doing that. Uh, Saturdays is, it is important to find a balance between pleasure and your to-do list. Try to do a bit of both today and see how you feel. Again, great, great encouragement. Sundays was, if you're home with children, make a schedule for them and try to maintain a sense of normal routines. Well, a lot of us, I know when my kids were young too, um, and now they're home, uh, doing school from home, uh, we, have to, we have to keep balanced and we have to uh, make sure that we're not too hard on each other um, when, we, when we change our routines and make, make some kind of routine around that. And then uh, Mondays was re research shows that a good night's sleep helps us handle stress better. Avoid your phone before bed, sleep in a cool, quiet room. So there you have it, a few encouragements for the week, and uh, we'll talk again on Thursday. Have an awesome few days, and this is how I'm staying today. No makeup, no nothing. Well, I might actually have to put like actual clothes on when I go for a walk <laughs> later with the dogs, but I'll see you soon. Take care.